What's going on guys? This year is truly Angel C. Just doing my uh doing day one of my 75 day hard challenge. Now some of y'all may know, some of y'all may not know what 75 day hard is. Hold on, getting text messages. Um basically it's more of a, a mental challenge to just basically I would say sharpen your, your sword, sharpen, sharpen your mind, sharpen your will and to get shit done and hold yourself accountable. So basically what 75 hard consists of, first thing, easiest thing is uh, taking a progress pic daily. So every single day for 75 days straight, you take, take a picture in the morning or in the afternoon after a workout whatever it may be then you got one gallon of water to drink daily 10 reading 10 pages of a personal development book or some type of entrepreneurial book um, eat clean diet of your choice make sure it's like you can't incorporate cheat days for 75 days straight no drinking which is pretty easy for me. I mean, the eating part's not easy for me. I mean, the drinking and stuff like that and staying basically abstinent from those things, it's pretty easy for me. Um, two workouts, each 45 minutes long. It could be to your, to your liking. So one has to be inside and one has to be outdoors, regardless if it's raining, you know, just be smart about it. So one workout has to be inside and the other one outside. Now, let you on an inside tip this is not my first time doing this i've been failing at 75 hard since march now what i can tell you is the things i do struggle with it's not the workouts because the workouts are easy for me um it's not really the walk gallon of water a day it's reading the 10 pages and eating clean um so how i'm gonna break it up is I'll do my workouts daily, right? I'll get five strong days in, right? Those workouts usually be indoors. I'm gonna do two days of long distance running out of the week. And then the rest is gonna be push-ups, pull-ups, dumbbell work, and that's it. Um, but I'm not gonna not gonna kill myself. Last time I think when I first started, I was too excited about starting it. So I would start out and I would run every single day. I would run every single day. I was good for the first 20 days. and But that shit just starts wearing on you mentally. The little things. Just reading the 10 pages a day. Um, getting up and getting my workout in before work. So it was just mentally wearing on me. I did it for a good, like I said, 20 days. When I hit that 20 day mark, it's like you start getting the sugar cravings in the middle of the night. And like I turned into a zombie. So... This time, my goal is to shoot a video and, you know, update you guys on how I'm doing. I mean, it's not, I'm going to do my best to do one every other day, but to keep y'all updated. And I'm going to go ahead and post my progress picture every day on my Instagram. And, you know, take it day by day. Try to get my daily victories. And I think so far of the 75 hard, you know what I mean? I think I should be ending sometime, what is it, March 23rd? Got August, September. Oh, I should be finishing on my birthday. 70, 75 hard should be finishing directly on my birthday. Let me check. So I stand corrected. Uh, it will finish October the 6th, 75 hard. And that's when I'll have my cheat meal. Right now I'm doing my 45 minute walk on the outside. I set my timer and I'm just walking at my pace. And I just did my indoor workout, which was push-ups, pull-ups, some jumping jacks, you know, and some things like that. Um, yeah, my goal is, you know, on the days that I'm feeling super sore, focus on stretching indoors. And the days that, you know, I feel good and ready to go, um, I'll go ahead and uh, do my hard workouts. But which should be like four to five days out of the week and then focus on foam rolling and stretching on the indoors and then going for my walks and then two days out of the week do some type of high intensity cardio you know where i'm jogging at least three to five maybe six miles so every other day so i know on sunday i already got a 10 mile run planned the key is to plan a little bit ahead but focus on the day 
Um, anyways, if you like this video and you want to see more of me, I'm hopped up on pre-workout after work. So it's like about 6 o'clock. No, it's about 8 o'clock at night right now. The sun's still out. Summertime. Um, I'm coming up on my one year anniversary free from smoking marijuana which I'm very very proud of um, gotta pat yourself on the shoulder but job ain't done we gotta keep moving forward keep grinding towards our goals and um, I'll keep y'all posted and let y'all know how I'm doing alright stay stay blessed stay motivated stay grinding let's go